Well, there's a lot of great things going on in Kansas City right now. Obviously, as we're recording this, it's the Big 12 tournament, and there's 100,000 people downtown between the Big 12 and Planet Comic Con. And what we think is that more, there's more good things to come. So uh, there will be a groundbreaking on a new uh, residential, 25-story residential office tower, lots of development opportunities that are starting, and, we've, of course, we've got the town torn up. Uh, between uh, River Market and uh, Union Station building a $100 million streetcar system that's going to be up and running in 2015. So we're very excited about the, the status of downtown Kansas City. We think it's got a lot of energy. It's got a lot of vibe. It's attracting a lot of national and international attention. The uh, city's making a very concerted effort to go after the Republican National Convention in 2016. We think we've got a very good chance to do it. So uh, we think the stars are aligning for Kansas City, so we're going to be uh, aggressively trying to continue that uh, momentum and uh, keep the enthusiasm and excitement going because we think once uh, the energy in downtown uh, continues to develop, it's good for our uh, surrounding neighborhoods. So we are building half million dollar speculative homes east of Troost in our Beacon Hill neighborhood. We're seeing a lot of development in our west side neighborhood and in our northeast neighborhoods, Skerritt and Pendleton Heights. So there's a tremendous amount of activity occurring around the central part of the city. I'll try to provide an update on all those various activities, but we really just need to continue that enthusiasm and that momentum for the city.